What's up guys, Shambles11, and we're back with yet another new Xbox Experience video. It feels like only a day since we've been here, uh, but on Major Nelson's Twitter feed today, uh, he said there is a brand new app available for us all to try. So, um, what we need to do is go into um, your games and your apps. And uh, when we go down to the app section, finally, we're going to head all the way down to the Xbox Preview dashboard. Um, and in this section here, once it's loaded properly, instead of just crashing on me. Um, okay, you'll see down here we've got beta games and apps, which is the new section. Um, not only now are we going to be beta testing the operating system, we're also going to be beta testing various apps as well. Uh, and in here you can click on uh, the new community calendar. You click on this and it will allow you to, it will say install um, instead of launch because obviously I've already got mine and then once it has downloaded it's very very quick, it's a very small file we can launch it and this is the brand new community calendar um, which is a pretty cool thing really. Um, it allows us to see all sorts of various things except mine is been up a while and by the look of it this is crashed as well. Yes it has, let's just reload it. The joys of being a beta tester people. Uh, but there you go, if you hadn't already got it in the background it would have loaded like this. And um, these are the new things we can see. So every day um, we've got for today, we've got uh, tomorrow's events and so on and so on, all the way through. We can see various events happening like planned live streams we can watch, we have the Green is Games being launched, um, we have sweepstakes, we have um, all sorts of things. And um, if we head up to where it says Category 9 selected we can click on this and we can filter. So you can see better um, rather than me waffling on we've got community programming free stuff game add-ons game launch game of fame gatherings live streams sweepstakes and tournaments and you can just filter these so um, if like me you just enjoy um, getting things and most importantly getting free things uh, we can filter out all these things here and there we go we can see that um, we've got new game being released on the 10th um, we've got a new game coming on the 13th we've got all the way through and it goes through quite far now it's not completely uh, up to date because I know I'm fairly certain 1st of December is um, Rainbow Six Siege uh, coming out and that's not on there but you can see some of the big ones so we've obviously got uh, Star Wars Battlefront Rise of the Tomb Raider uh, some game called Halo 5 Guardians that I don't think anyone's heard of uh, and the next one to release on here will be by the look of it Bedlam um, so I really like this app it's really cool um, there's plenty of things you know going on they've clearly got planned they're thinking this through um, and then uh, you know, this it's just nice. You can just you know see what's going on. You don't have to worry about when games are, are coming out. You you can just see for yourself. Uh, and, and once you're done, you can click on the surveys bit at the top. And I've already done mine, but there is a, a, a rating one for the calendar app itself, and then just for beta games and apps in general. I mean, we've only had this one to try, so there is only one question: Do you like it? Um, I think mean, it's a good thing. It gets us more involved um, as beta testers. Uh, again, guys, this isn't. Uh, you know, uh, early access. It is a beta. There probably are things wrong with it. I didn't have a single issue with it. Um, I, I think it's a nice little thing. It's not, you know, necessarily a, a must-have, but uh, I, I like the option that it's there. So um, very good, very good indeed. Anyway, thank you for watching. Until next time.